Thank you, Dr. Cole. It is an honor to represent the graduate student body of the King's University this evening. Before I continue, I personally want to thank a few people. Thank you all my family members who are here this evening and have supported me these past six years in seminary. Grandma Nyla, Mom, mm -hmm. Dad, Marcia, mm -hmm. Uncle Dick, and Aunt Jean. Mm -hmm. I do not take your unwavering love and support for granted. My deepest gratitude goes to my academic advisor, Dr. Hunsinger, and the Dean of the Jack W. Hayford School of Graduate Studies, Dr. Cole, for their wisdom and godly counsel. And I am immensely grateful to all the people at the King's University who have deeply impacted me. Professor Lane, Julie Cole, Dr. Luter, Dr. Call, among too many others to name. And on behalf of the graduate school student body, thank you, Pastor Jack, for your legacy, which has now blossomed into an ATS accreditation for the King's Seminary. It has been, yes. It has been quite the journey, and we are tremendously proud to be a part of it. Well, fellow classmates, we made it. After all those late nights studying and grueling exams, we have come to the finish line. When I asked the Lord what he wanted me to share with you this evening, he was direct. No question about it. He gave me a prophetic declaration for us, our family members and friends. Before I share the declaration, I will tease y'all with the theme of it. <laughs> we will worship our way through life. Indeed, we will adore the Father and glorify Jesus and worship the Holy Spirit as we make our way through life. For that is the means through which our highest attainment is achieved. Pastor Jack wrote about this in his book, Majesty. Our highest attainment comes through glorifying him who is worthy of all glory, one who worships the Lord, looking to the unseen rather than to the seen, as we go through our present trials, will find what Paul calls an eternal weight of glory working in his life. Fellow classmates, we have experienced some trials recently, and God has worked some weights of glory inside us as well. But let us look ahead. Let us be encouraged by the following prophetic declaration. When our world is fraught with a pandemic, we will worship our way through life. Amen. When there are riots in the streets and moments of great social unrest, we will worship our way through life. When there are turbulent political elections, we will worship our way through life. Through whatever the enemy throws our way, we will worship our way through life. Yeah. And when we struggle with our final dying breaths, we will worship our way to the other side of life, where we will worship God forever and ever. Yeah. That is our prophetic declaration. God bless the King's University, and may God bless you all.